welcome to the Ghana Art Family. If you got a question or a suggestion, uh, hit us up on the uh, social media sites that will be down in the description below. Today we're going to be talking about beginner things artists should learn before drawing the, uh, the human figure or starting to draw in general. Now these are tips I wish I knew when I was starting out drawing. When I was just beginning to learn how to draw at my uh, college or so, they just uh, put us into the lines then without knowing some basic knowledge of certain uh, certain techniques regarding drawing. And so in this video, I'm going to explain some tips for beginner drawers so that they could take this and use this in their artistic evolution. And sometimes it's to avoid relearning some techniques because you may not have learned properly from the start. So relearning isn't that much of a big deal if you're if you're already used to drawing something that's that looks viewable then your relearning your process will be a lot faster you'll learn a lot faster compared to someone who's just now or just starting to pick up a pencil now one thing i wish i knew before starting drawing in general is the concept of mastering the mannequin you know, so you wouldn't have to need a mannequin in real life in front of you. You'll have it memorized in your head. And so what mastering the mannequin mentally is like just using like basic shapes, you know, of uh, oval or cylinder. Starting out in a very simplistic form and then moving on to a, a complex form. Art is very simplistic. It just gives the illusion of complexity. So everything starts out from a, a basic shape. And from that basic shape, you start to add more details. So I remember just last year when I was uh, taking a uh, figure drawing class, I started to notice a, a few things that didn't match up with the way I was learning. Because, and I thought that everything was from observation. Everything I learned was from observation, but I didn't really understand the mechanics of how the human anatomy worked. So. I took it upon myself to actually understand the fundamentals and not only did it improve my drawing speed and whatnot, but it also improved my art as a whole. And within a month, that was when I started to understand the mannequin a lot more. Now the second thing I wish I knew when I started to learn how to draw is uh, understanding the uh, proportions, understanding uh, the different uh, head measures of the body. So for example, uh, the torso portion would be like two heads and you know, the head would be one head, obviously. Um, the pelvis area would be one head, etc. cetera. Um, just understanding the, uh, the different measurements before starting to actually draw the figure. Cause there are some artists that would, uh, that spend like a good three years or so, uh, with their art styles and, and their levels and it would just remain uh, static just due to the fact that they didn't uh, have the understanding of certain fundamentals. So for me, like I had to revisit that over the summer to uh, actually refine myself of how everything works. And, and on top of that, I was studying anatomy as well. So understanding all of that not only uh, improved my drawing speed, but it, it also improved uh, just my understanding of the, the figure in general. And uh, tip number three is understanding perspective. Now, you don't have to draw any like complex backgrounds or anything of that sort. Uh, just understand how perspective works just using uh, the basic shape of a, uh, of, of a rectangle or a square. And just practice doing the perspective with a rectangle in a square over and over again before you pick up a pencil to actually draw a, uh, a, a, an actual art piece, a finished art piece, an art piece that you actually want to do. Just understanding these, uh, these three uh, basic start out concepts will greatly improve you in the long run as an artist in general for now. But to get to the next level after, you've un after you have an understanding of these three, is study the anatomy of different parts of the body and that's it. And one more thing before we live. Uh, if you're a comic artist, uh, 
I'd recommend to uh, start making a comic after you have an understanding of or or getting used to uh, mastering or having just having an understanding of the three basic concept three basic concepts that I uh, mentioned in the uh, video. So the reason why you would want to start a comic is because for each page you're constantly being you're constantly uh, reinforcing all the things that you learn and not only that you're constantly reinforcing all the stuff that you learn but uh, you're making a comic so it's something that you're actually passionate about you have a, a actual goal in mind as opposed to just uh, sketching or whatnot you'll have something that motivates you so that may be a comic and once you have that motivation you just want to uh, for each page Remember the three basic steps, the three basic concepts, and continuously draw. So it may be, uh, you know, 20 pages long, it may be 40 pages long, etc., however you want it to be. And as you go on and on to continue, like, by the time you make your, I feel, your second or third comic, you'll have an understanding of where you want to go. And by that time, you may want to evolve even more hopefully you want to evolve even more in your art so you may want to look into anatomy or you may want to look into anatomy before you start your first comic but it's up to you you know slow and steady so just understand the three basic concepts and whatnot and then just you know make a comic out of it and by that time you'll have everything will be in ingrained into your mind and you'll have it naturally flowing into you so for me for example since I'm like I just started looking into anatomy a few like two months ago or so and understanding the mannequin and whatnot, I started to redo some pages in my uh, first chapter just to get my practice in. You'll 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 see it. I believe I'll I'll post a before and after in the uh, in the video. And that will be the video. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, join the family by hitting that subscribe button down below, and uh, that'll be all. Peace.